This video is brought to you by Alienware, featuring Intel Core i7 processors. Start gaming. On the floor below me, maybe? What the fuck? <sighs> Guys, I think I just shot my pants. Sounds like he's above me. Yeah, he was above me, wasn't he? I think he's down this corridor. Let's pick up the pace a bit. I can hear him. There's another guy in front of me. That one bang. Is there another guy there? I feel like there's one more guy here on this corner. Come on, let's see. Where is he? I got him. <laughs> Ooh, there's gonna be a lot of loot here, boys. I'm gonna test out grenades. I just wanna see what happens. Ready? Oh, the light flickers and everything. <laughs> We're making a pile of bodies here, guys. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> I think those two were AI. Holy shit, the sounds, guys, they're so scary. Okay, he's dead. There's a confirmed kill right there. What did he have? Just a pistol. Oh my god, guys, what is going on over there? I feel like someone's just been murdered. It was in there, wasn't it? I'm just looking for movement right now. Hit him a couple times. Reload. He might be bandaging right now. Or did I kill him? I think I might have killed him. Let's go see if we got him. Yeah, we got him. I actually shot him through the fence panel there. That's cool. So the game's got bullet penetration. Oh, hello. What is that? That looks like a shotgun. He killed someone here as well. I can hear someone. I think there's someone down here. On my right. Or are they below me? I can't tell. I think they're through here. The sounds are getting louder and louder. I'm going to open this door very slowly. A 
Could be above me. Oh. <coughs> Check this out, man. This is so cool. The amount of modding you can do on the weapons. All these different sights you can put on. Hand guards. It's got like a alternate iron sight as well. Like a side angled sight if you want to change it up, I think. I mean, that's a lot of stuff you can change, isn't it, on all the weapons. What should we use now? Should we put this on? Let's go with that. Oh, that scope. That's so hard to aim with. Oh my goodness. There should be like eight other players on this map. Oh. I think I heard something then. I can hear someone running around. Are they above me or are they there? I got shot in the right arm, didn't I? Can I use this? First aid kit. Kinda hard to see for that scope. Yes. <laughs> the sound is amazing. Sounds really, really cool. The detail on the guns as well. I'm like Batman right now, just chilling out on the rafters. I don't think that guy had much of a chance there, though, did he? Oh, got him! Boys, it is on. This is quite intense, I have to say, like, they've done a very good job of making it feel, c like, crunchy and real, you know? Like, it feels very suspenseful and tactical. So I need to go and try and find the exit. It could be in any number of places. So if I wanted to now, I could just leave, but I haven't actually gained any loot. Because that's the exit there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and loot some of those bodies that I killed. But, of course, that's very dangerous and I'm probably going to get killed in the process. Why are you laughing at me, dude? What the hell? Here we go. I think this is an exit. But you could. There's nothing stopping someone just camping this. They could very easily do that. But we actually managed to survive that one and we got a couple bits of loot out of it. Definitely some XP there as well. What the fuck, guys? <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Why were they just spit? <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that's broke me. <laughs> that's absolutely broke me, man. That looks so, <laughs> that looks so fucking stupid. <laughs> okay, right. <laughs> so they, <laughs> they got a shotgun. 
Unsearched. Oh, I have to search their pockets. <laughs> Give me that shotgun. That's not a helmet, that's a Superman cap. They can't use that logo. That's copyrighted. Shit. I hear someone. Is it another spin bar? Oh, we got another spin bar, guys, look. See? He spin by <laughs> He looks like a ghost. Oh man. I'm so scared right now. Oh, he spin by Look. Oh, he disappeared. Oh, he's back. Okay. Right. You know, it is alpha. We've got to give it. We've got to give it some time. I'm sure there's going to be many bugs in this game. Is it another swim bar? Oh shit. What? Swim bar! I don't know what's going on guys. I've got a pistol. Suppressed. M4A1. And I've also got this, my shot. Oh, look at that. Yo, how is this game on Unity, man? Oh, when you go up to a wall as well, it puts the gun up like that, so you can't, like, head glitch. I mean, graphically, it's very impressive, I have to say. Unity guy, this is running on Unity, which I think is a free engine. I can search these. Oh my god, he opens the drawer and everything. Nothing. Oh, there was something there. There was something there. What's that? Cigarettes. Okay, I'll take that. It's in the top one. What was this? Apple juice. I can hear Russians. Get ready for combat. It's not reloaded, guys. He's just run off. I can't tell where they are. Oh, there's one down there. Oh, it's got a spin bar. Why do they have to spin bar? Oh, so you can only breach the direction of the door. That's cool. I like that. So I should be able to breach this. Go, go, go! No one here. The mouse feels a bit icky. A tea plug. That sounds like a sex toy. Oh, there we go. That's got a light on it. Oh yeah, it's an exit sign. Extraction. So now, I think we get to keep all that loot that we just got. Um, survived. I got some XP as well. I need like a basic kit that I can take in, because apparently... Someone said in the chat that whatever you take in... And you die, you lose, unless it's in the gamma container. But the gamma container... Oh, you can actually fit a rifle in there. No, you can't. You can't fit... You can get a pistol in there. Yeah, I'm just gonna join a PvP game. Should we take an AK in? That's, that looks pretty dope, doesn't it? Inspect, what kind of ammo does it take? 6L31. So maybe if I take one extra mag. I need a tactical rig on, don't I? Tactical rig. Put that in there. That's like, in case I get shot, I think. I guess we could just go with this. Should we just go into a PvP game with an AK? One extra magazine. And some meds. And just see how it goes. 
Oh my god, it's night time and I don't have night vision. <laughs> I don't have a flashlight. Oh, I do have a flashlight. Yes! Everyone else is going to be wandering around with, uh, with night vision and they'll be like, the fuck is that idiot doing there? <laughs> it's a dead giveaway, isn't it? Well, if I kill someone, I'll be able to steal some night vision goggles, if they've got them. But the thing is, if they've got night vision goggles, that puts them at a distinct advantage over me right now, doesn't it? I mean, look at this. Shall I... I'll attract some attention, shall I? Hey, look, I'm the stupid guy who didn't bring night vision goggles over here. Let's do some Morse code. It is really spooky. Can I even get over that fence? <gasps> I see someone. Oh. I think I killed him, guys. I think I killed him. Yes. Has he got night vision goggles, though? He only had a pistol, I think. Oh, man. That was so tense. Hold on, I'm going to turn my flashlight off before I do this. Here we go. Search. He has a backpack as well. He had a shotgun, look. Come on, tell me there's night vision goggles in there. No, he didn't have any night vision goggles. Damn it. He had this though. Can I take his backpack? Oh, we are in the money, guys. We are in the money right now. Oh my god, dude, that scared the shit out of me. Holy shit. Oh, where did he come from? Jesus, I don't think he saw me. He didn't have goggles on either. Wow. Tactical rig, AVS. That honestly scared the crap out of me. Now, is anyone else gonna fucking creep up on me or what? Are we done? Are we done here? Oh, you go prone like that. Yeah, so I can put this on my back. There we go. Now I've got a shotgun. So basically, two private military companies are fighting and civilians are evacuated. And then you're either a private gunman, a shady character, or a local scavenger. Otherwise, you're trying to escape the hellhole or stay and kill people for your own enjoyment. Well, I'd, I'd stay around and kill people for my own enjoyment, I think. A CPU fan? What the fuck am I going to do with a CPU fan? Matches. What's this? Condensed milk. Do I need to eat and drink? I hadn't even thought about that. Is that my health? There, I think that's my health. That's drink, I'm guessing. That's energy. Oh, I've got a power supply, guys. I can build it. I can build a fucking PC. Like, I'm not sure exactly what sort of game this is, to be honest. It's obviously got, like, survival game roots, but... I'm not sure what they're going for here, do you know? Because it's not like... It wasn't like DayZ where I spawn in with nothing. I could choose to spawn in with weapons from my stash. But then if I die, I'm going to lose that stuff. Okay, well, this is... Is this the exit? I guess it is. You just keep going and that's it. GG. We made it. It is night time, but this time, I've got night vision goggles. I feel like in this game, patience is going to be key though. Like, it's going to reward camping heavily, because <laughs> you die really quick.
Oh my god. Yo, know, that guy came out of nowhere. Oh man, that was spooky. This just goes on forever. There's a fucking petrol station here. Can I go inside the petrol station? Oh my god. That's cool. Very detailed, isn't it? Oh, I have a key for this, do I? Does that mean there's going to be some good loot in here? It's a safe. What's in the safe? A gold chain. Are you serious? What am I going to do with a gold chain? Oh shit, what the fuck was that? Yo, yo, spin bot! Bruh. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck was that? Hey guys, Jack from the future here. So that's some highlights of my very first time playing Escape from Tarkov. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, hit that thumbs up button down below, and also leave a comment to let me know what your initial impressions are based on the footage. Obviously, there's been a lot of hype for this game. It's very early alpha at the moment, so there are a load of bugs, as you saw, Mr. Spinny Aimbot Guy. But there's also a lot of promise here. I think the graphics are excellent, the gunplay feels tense and tactical. I just can't wait until this game goes into a larger free roam game and they've got all of the levels connected together because at the moment it kind of plays like a weird survival team deathmatch and it seems like right now the overall goal is to get as much loot in your stash as possible. Apparently the devs are working on like a 64 player open world version with all the maps though and I'm definitely going to be following the development of this game and updating you guys accordingly so look forward to more content in the future. Now this will be the last video of 2016 on the Jack Frags channel, so I wanted to say a massive thank you to everyone that watches my videos and supports what I do here on YouTube because I just love being creative and I've dedicated most of the last five years of my life to building what we have here and you know what I'm really happy with the way things are going so from the bottom of my heart thank you so so much and finally for today a sponsored message from Alienware I've done all sorts of videos with their hardware in the past from crazy spaceship looking PCs to gaming laptops and steam boxes if you're interested in checking out any of their hardware there's a link down in the description below that you can click on and have a gander with that said I'm going to sign off for the year guys I hope you have a fantastic fantastic 2017 make the most of it and i'll see you in the next one